One Cornish beach, great weather, 150 of the world's top surfers and some of the best conditions for years. The key ingredients for the 2008 Fat Face Night Surf. The legendary Fat Face Night Series is now attracting riders from across the globe, and Night Surf is no exception. From New Zealand, South Africa, and all over Europe they came for one of the best loved events on the UK tour. In the longboard, local surfer Ben Skinner ranked the highest score of the contest. A perfect 10 in his quarterfinals set the standard that others struggled to follow. With room for some big turns on the surf, Ben was untouchable in his semi and walked the final, leaving fellow Cornishman Sam Bleakley in second. I had a good day. Started good early on. Um, that early, early heat, the waves were really good. And um, yeah, I got lucky, had a really nice wave. Um, Stoke got 10. And then the next heat, just, you know, consistently surfed right throughout the whole thing, so I'm pretty happy, really. Good day. In the Women's Open, Ireland's Nicole Morgan harnessed the best of the Cornish surf for her third Fat Face Night Series title. I love the Fat Face Night Surf. It's probably my favourite event on tour. Just so many elements make it so cool, like the, the bay, like the dino, the steps, the rustic glaze. It's a little, small little cove, and the lights are cool at night, and there's always a big crowd and a band, and then fireworks to celebrate at the end if we've had a good day. The Men's Open was a truly international affair. Kiwi Nick White and South Africa's Ruben Pierce both looking strong and a tough match for local surfers Matt Capel and Alan Stokes. Nick and Matt both won their semis, but in the final Nick had the best of the surf and some high scoring waves gave him the 2008 Fat Face Night Surf title. Yeah, it's Stoke, it's such a cool event and stuff. Well, it's the first time we've ever competed on a British event and uh, this is like such a special event, being at night and everything like that, so it's just, yeah, really stoked to win.